Greetings, I am Bronan the Marauder, and it is my favorite time of year, Fashnacht. This is the time for us to crush Father Winter, drive him before us, and hear the celebration of the people. That means it's springtime, bros. Time for the plants and the animals to make for the breeding. Ah, Bronan now feels chill. Time to blow popsicle stand. It's time to chill in my throne. Let Bronan tell you a few things about Fashnacht. First rule of Fashnacht, you must have costume. All year, you spend looking like your same old gnarly self. Fashnacht is the perfect time to shake things up, baby. The second rule of Fashnacht, chillax, bro. The last rule of Fashnacht, bring plenty of food and a low ammo consumption weapon. Bronan is ready. It's time to split for Helvetia. Houston, the Broninator has landed. We now find ourselves at the totally chill village of Helvetia. Bronan has brought his Gatling gun and a shish kebab. The Gatling gun has a low rate of fire and is highly accurate. And the shish kebab can be used with friendly fire to heal the robot's body. So the first thing I do is totally make sure that the cars are blown up, bro. There's one on this side and two jeeps on the far side of town. Dude, that would be so gnarly if they blew up right next to the robots. Totally harshitude. Be sure to maraudinate this pile of wood. It will come very handy for building a fire later, buddy. Okay, it's time to move into town and maraudinate other things that you will need. Like... These mugs here, they are everywhere. Collect them. So this is the baker. And this is the music place, which has another stein. So it's the time to run across the street here. Up here you'll find the beeswax house. It has lots of beeswax. And there's also bees. So make sure to take them out. They can be annoying. You could say, they bug me. So now I'm sure you are saying, Bro, man, now that my inventory is stuffed full of shit, what do I do with it? At the top of the hour, you show up in town, and you wait for somebody to talk to the robot and start the whole thing. For each event, there will be five robot bros, and they all have jobs for you to be doing. So once you start, you'll need to be running all over town and looking for these guys. So I see the first robot I'm going to go to is the music robot. He's so chill. I'm glad to see they have Bronat's battle horn here. I will play it for you. You sit here and play until the little bar is filled up, and then you can go do something else. Alright, now that the battle tuba has been played. We'll go hang loose over here at the bankers and see if he needs any frog's eggs. Egg count greater than required egg count. Donut functions complete. Resume parade march protocol. Goodbye. Okay, so somebody gave the robot all the eggs. This stream here is where you find frog eggs under the bridge. Okay, we'll go check on the butcher bot. He collects intestines from small animals and makes sausages. Looks like he's done. So, I'm going to head up to Candle Maker, see if the robot is here. And he is not. The next robot is up here. He's in charge of making bonfires. But I see no robot, so forget him. This little building is a robot that collects the steins. He is not here, so forget him. So the only robot we did not look for is the beeswax guy. I will go back here and see if the robots are already lined up. Yeah, the awful robots here. That means that the bank of robots is the last one to come and he takes forever to get to. So, hang out, enjoy the show of the Andersons, and uh, wait. I will get into my favorite spot of chill at the back of the line. Okay, slow robots is here. Parade, march, start, location, 
verified mask application commencing. And now we are waiting for the master of ceremonies, Brobot. He'll be here to start things shortly. This part has an enhanced version of the song they play. It's called One More Peels. Uh oh, stupid robot's broken again. Time to kill the frogs. The frogs are usually low level, and there are so many bros around that you hardly have to do anything. Right on, man. You use up that 50 cal. Sometimes the frogs show up and they're totally buff, bro. They're like 40th level. I think that's after a nuke zone has hit the place. So, there's a lot of time to hang out and be chill. This event is nice for low levels because it's easy. Die, you frogs of doom. Ah, what sorcery is this? It's raining toads. Isn't that like a plague? So this would be a time I pull out my shish kebab and make sure the robots are healed by hitting them. It's so fun. Nothing even got close to them though, so I'm pretty sure they're not hurt. Move you oppressor of the workers. Pass by the wax house. People like to take beeswax and it makes bees and they come out and attack the robots and hurt them. That also slows them down so that they get behind the leader. It totally sucks. Bro. So now super mutants come from everywhere. They are so not chill. These suiciders can be very dangerous, but your true foes are the ones with the guns and the Molotov cocktails. You can stop a suicider easy before it reaches the robots, but if someone throws a Molotov cocktail and hits them all, you're in big trouble. Hopefully you'll have a shish kebab and the friendly fire perk, then you can just fix the robots. Maltos makes it really hard though. Lots of clicking.
So normally I'll just hang out and be clicking the VATS button over and over again. If mutants come inside of this building, they will shoot through the windows and cheat. Fuck those guys. Time for fixing the robot, bro. Here you go, buddy. I have my new eye off, so I have no idea if they're hurt, but you know, it's always good to be safe and never be passing up a chance to hit robots. Whoa, personal space, bro. Ha! Move, robot. Gobnack commands it. If you notice, many of these people, they're not saying a darn thing. I'm pretty sure I had my mic on and talked to them. Yo, dudes, looks like we're in the home stretch for this thing. Just to the rides is a Jeep. And if it was not exploded, this would be the perfect time for a griefer to blow it up and ruin our fun. But it is already taken care of, so... <laughs> so at this point, bro, the robots march up towards the church, and a bunch of insects and wolves come from behind. There will also be a legendary mega sloth, but... Don't worry about it, he gets two shots every time anyway. The main focus is to keep the robots alive. That's where you get maximum reward at the end. Now to participate in a common Anderson children ritual. Now that we've done the circuit, so to speak, it's time to chase away old man Witch in our most glorious of Helvetian traditions. Gather around the bar, friends, and rid our town of the anthropomorphic representation of the season. Burn him, 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 burn him. And that is Fashnacht. Farewell.